Warren's Public Library. For most, it's a place to find books, media, and quiet places. Rarely do you think of making noise in the library, but located on the bottom floor lies a place where patrons do just that. <laughs> The Sound and Vision Studio provides uh, an opportunity for all Lawrence residents to record basically anything. I guarantee you no other library in the world has that thing. People want this. The, the residents of Lawrence, this is something that they want. So well, you have access down here to all these instruments. I mean, sure you've got the really big complicated beast back there, but you've got guitars out there, you've got a drum set, you've got tons of great virtual synths in the computer. So. That's cool, Brad. It is, yeah. yeah. It's very, nice really work. You know, we see it in, you know, rock bands and hip hop bands, but we also see it in, you know, poets coming in to read their work. We see it in grandmas coming in to read uh, bedtime stories that then their grandkids can keep on their phones that live half the country away. I mean, it's not just for people making rock and roll, it's for everybody. So the Lawrence people are really creative about how they use this space, and, you know, every week there's someone new coming in with a, something I hadn't even thought of.